I'm Kate Johnson and we're here in beautiful Harvey Bay. This is about the heart of it actually and right over behind us we've got 122 k's worth of sand dunes that are awesome in our cruiser. Check out our little baby over here. She does great on the corners sitting on about 80 k's. As long as there's not many backpackers you'll be fine. <laughs> We're here for issue 22 of NAFA magazine, so it's the special Christmas edition for 2011 this year. It's going to be epic. We've spent a good few days out on the sea, Fraser Island, in and around Harvey Bay, so we've got about 12 pages worth of fishing tips and swimwear, all to show you for the next edition. And I heard you went out on the Alley J. The Alley J. Mm. Wasn't that fun? <laughs> so you've shot a cover shot? We have. It's, um, we caught a, a beautiful coronation fish, so that was the beauty that we shot with out the back. I would have to admit I did get a little bit seasick, but you know, who doesn't when you have rough seas like that? Beautiful the second day, I think you'll admit that all the photos and the makeup and how it was done just look perfect, so it's going to be a great cover edition. And what sort of shots, what sort of themes did you get up to? Oh, we did quite a few. We had quite a few different sponsored outfits. So as you can see, one piece that I'm wearing now is Man Eater Swimwear from the beautiful Gold Coast. We've had a whole bunch of items from Waco, gloves, fishing rods, eskies. So we've had a lot of props to work with, which you can, com I guess, combine the girl next door with a bit of sexiness. And yeah, it's just been an entire week's worth of shooting and fishing. <laughs> what do you think of Fraser Island? I loved it. I reckon we'll definitely be back again. Uh, it was my first time out so it was great to lose my virginity on Fraser Island with the Napa crew. It's uh, great for driving, particularly for the sand dunes. A lot of backpackers out there, weekend warriors, but if you're a beginner or you're a hardcore four-wheel driver, it's definitely the place to be. Just watch out for the dingoes and the blowflies. <laughs>